good afternoon, uh, Zampi. This afternoon, we just wanted to take uh, this moment to appreciate our brothers and sisters, not only those that are over here, but even those that are in, uh, at home, because they have been always there to represent us, even when we are not there. So, my sister, why was it to see our brothers on the other side? Um. Good afternoon everyone, um, I'm just going to uh, speak the honest truth that is so evident uh, to everyone because we all saw the video uh, and the pictures. First of all, I just want to thank the people who are behind, you know, just sharing the information. Sometimes you don't have to call anybody for information, but you know, thanks to you for just bringing it up on the page and just being transparent. We've been so encouraged. I'm like, oh, it's not just this incident that has happened. In anything that is going on, even in our lives here in Pittsburgh or back home, we can always bring it to you and uh, you can equip people with that information. So I just wanted to say thank you so much for putting us out there just to be so transparent. Uh, it was such an encouraging uh, situation. Everything that happened, sad situation, but we have seen the positive vibe that came out of this situation you know just yesterday looking at everything how it went how everybody came together people that you know were formerly living in Pittsburgh and it was nice to see them you know I was looking at Uncle George Mwambazi I was like wow this man of God is going strong you know people like Ogi you know my nephew Augustine Kaembe I saw him and just the tribute that he brought forth to you know, to the funeral, talking about Mainza, how they grew up together, how they went to school together. It was very refreshing to know that indeed he has impacted so many lives. And just to know that Ogi himself lived in Pittsburgh once upon a time and just going back home to Zambia and even speaking to, you know, he said, I'm representing the youth. Wow. You know, I was like, wow, this is the kind of Ubuntu that we are looking for. Mm. We are looking forward to things like that, even if our young children they can come and be in attendance at the funeral like that and Ogi, the way he spoke, I was just so encouraged. I said, look, now he's going to live on with that legacy of saying, let me push forward, let me do what I have to do because Mainza had you know, left him with that impactation. Like you have to go, you have to be a go-getter. Mm. If you have to be a football uh, athlete, be one. Mm. If you have to be a musician, be one. Let's just fight through and be, you know, who we want to be on earth. Like, uh, you know, they said yesterday, it was very encouraging. Everybody that showed up in numbers, we love you, we saw you, we recognize you. We just want to say thank you. Thank you so much. And uh, thank you, Uncle Lenny, for the privilege. You're welcome. Thank you. Sister. Yes. Uh, actually, I'll just conquer with uh, Sister Kristen, my sister right here. Thank you so much for just giving us the update about everything. We followed everything. Even if we were not in Zambia, we watched the film. We thank God for the social media. You know, uh, I just want to thank God for the spirit of Ubuntu. That's why it doesn't matter where you go. We are family. You can't just stay in one corner and say, me, I don't like people or I don't talk to this one. Yes. You never know when a problem comes. And that problem really needs people. That's why, despite our differences, we just have to put them aside and come together. Just as she said, watching that funeral yesterday, seeing the people that live, the family, actually I'm not going to say people, this is a family that we live together in Pittsburgh and they showed up and they showed forth. Mm. It was very, very encouraging that wherever you are, you can't suffer if you have people. Mm. We are a family, wherever you go, you go to South Africa. If you are good with people, it will be easy for you to just be embraced and be around people. So we need one another. Thank you so much, Uncle Lenny, for the opportunity to speak. You're welcome. Yeah. Thank so you. brothers and sisters, this is what we're supposed to do. All the time, let's try to bring the kids together. Let the kids see or know what we are doing. Look at Oga, it's a good example. He lived in this land, he, grew, he, lived with, he, was, he was living with us. He saw when we were, the parents were taking him for the funerals, but there he is an our ambassador. He's an ambassador in our community, in Africa, representing this community, bringing the spirit of Ubuntu. So wherever we go, you can imagine they left this place there in Zambia, yes. but they are very much part of us. Yes. We didn't just wanted to overlook without them being acknowledged. We just wanted to take this time to say thank you so much for being there for us. Thank we you. love you. Thank you. Bye-bye.